Hey, this is Christy Sanders from Plan Your Meetings, and I had something uh, that I thought was one of the most prosaic things that you have to deal with as a meeting planner, but I thought it was worth mentioning. They are badges, uh, and I saw a couple of cool ideas, and so I just thought, you know, it's something that almost everyone has. They're really hard to get rid of just because people like to know who they're talking to at events. So here's some things to think about when you're ordering badges or putting them together. <clears throat> This is a little badge that I got from Bark World. Um, it was planned by Denise Quashi, who's one of our contributors. It's a social media conference for people who write pet blogs, things like that. Um, really nice branding for nice color. You can see what the event actually is. Sometimes it's kind of just black and white or really, really teeny. Um, the name is really easy to read, but what I thought was really cool about this badge is because it was social media, because she wanted to encourage conversations um, and drive awareness, she actually has this little thing because some people came with their pets. The two legs name for the person who was attending uh, has their Twitter name. She also put the hashtag so that if you were going to tweet, you didn't have to look for where you had to tweet about. Um, and then also she had the Twitter identity for the conference itself. So I thought that was very, very smart. Um, something you might want to consider now that more and more people are engaging. Um, the actual lanyard is branded by one of the sponsors. If you don't do that, um, or if you're not just recycling, because a lot of times you'll have some leftover from a previous event and it's just greener to do that rather than to purchase new ones. Um, if you do have to purchase new ones, don't forget your branding. Okay, and this is something else that I thought was really, really cool. You probably are seeing QR codes all over the place. Um, this one I thought was really neat. This is from the Social Media Tourism Symposium. Um, if you scan this barcode, you actually get a V card where you can download my information, including how to connect with me on LinkedIn, where my Twitter handle is, and I think maybe even Facebook. But those are different options that are available to you now. Um, this was organized by 44 Doors. There are also some others. You just do a Google search for QR codes. Um, you'll find a bunch now that you can do online. And then what was even cooler is on the very back, if you scan this, you got a virtual, actually, it's I guess it's more technically called an augmented reality app. Um, it's Layar, uh, and this is what our agenda was scheduled on. So you could hold your phone and you would use a map and tell you where events were gonna be happening, but then it also had our full schedule of events. We wouldn't have to carry any paper around with us. So those are a couple of cool badge ideas. Plan well and prosper. For more ideas, go to planyourmeetings.com.